Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, we're going to go ahead and load up the bug settings using a different method. We'll be using the BDJ. Now, this here method doesn't require the internet or doesn't require any doggles or anything. It just uh, you just need a blank DVD and obviously a DVD burner. Um, but yeah, this was originally disclosed by the Flow. Later on, ported over by Slurs Grove Inspector Dev. Um, John Tornblum here has been playing around with it, and he managed to get us debug settings on the uh, the BDJ. So uh, what we're going to need to do is, I will leave a link in the description here. You can go ahead and uh, just follow along, and if he does update it, you can go ahead and comply the file and create the ISO. But I've already went ahead and done all that. Um, so I do have a ISO here, and I've already went ahead and downloaded it. I will leave a link in the description. You can go ahead and download it. But uh, yeah, once you do get it downloaded, we'll be just using image burn here. It's only a small file, so it shouldn't take very long to burn. Uh, I'm just going to just drag it over, and then just go ahead and write. Now I'm using a DVD RW, so it's asking me to overwrite. I'll just say yes to it, let it go, give it uh, 30 seconds, if that there. It's very quick here to, to copy it on. Uh, once it starts getting going, you'll see how quick it actually goes. There we go. And it's starting. And there you go. Completed. Now, once it's done, um, we're going to be jumping over to the PS5. I've tested this on the PS5 3.00 uh and 4.03 it's going to work on the same versions as the web kit um there is a little speculation whether it will work for uh earlier versions obviously it's not going to work for later versions but the uh, earlier versions from 1.00 up to three uh well below three because three works um it's just a matter of uh testing it or whatever if anybody has it um, I think John was looking for people with uh, lower firmers to give it a try and maybe just uh, get that out of the way if it doesn't work or whatnot. But uh, yeah, we're going to jump over to my PS5 running uh, 3.00. Okay, so now we're over to the PS5 here. We'll go ahead and get logged in. Once we do get logged in up the top, we'll go over to our media tab there. And then as you can see, the uh, disc player does come up there. PS5, BDJB, debug settings enabled at John Tornblum. So we'll go ahead and hit uh, play on that. Give it a few seconds, 30 seconds or so. It goes pretty quick here. There we go. And trigger in UAF. Okay. Arbitrary RW achieved. Okay, a couple of more seconds here should pop up. There we go. Debug settings enabled. So if we go ahead and hit the PlayStation button, just uh, actually hold it in, and we jump over to our settings. We scroll down. We do have a debug settings now. Now I've tried this multiple times. Um, on the 3.00, I tried it uh, five times, and it crashed once it didn't wasn't successful now on 4.03 the five times it went straight through with no issues um i had never really tried more than that there i'm thinking it might be just a random time that you might end up getting it to fail um so you can give it a try um let me know in the comments below what uh how it worked out for you um i did get a couple of reports saying that it did crash so it, it might not be 100%, but it's uh, it's pretty close. I would say it's just right up there with the, the web kit, because uh, that's not 100% either. I had a few uh, crashes with that as well. But uh, yeah, we don't have FTP on this here yet. Um, hopefully we can see that there happen. Maybe it'll get an elf loader at the end and then launch it. Just, uh, just launch the FTP right straight from the disk. But we'll have to wait and see. I will leave a link for John's uh, GitHub there. Go ahead and just keep on checking him out. Maybe he'll update it and we'll get a, a later version. But uh, yeah, that's it for the video, guys. Just wanted to jump on, show you that there. You can uh, go ahead and load it up and check out debug settings. As for the options, they are pretty much the same. 
I don't I didn't see anything different so yeah I'm gonna leave the video at that I hope you did like it if you did go ahead and hit that like button really helps out the channel and if you're not subscribed already go ahead and hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching